organizations. I want to quickly talk about something that, um, you know, if you actually look it up, you won't find a whole lot about it. You kind of have to go deep to research it. And that is um, what is generally called really targeted dream incubation or AKA also dream engineering. All right, and this is very, very serious in terms of there's technologies that are not transparent on the market, things like such as when I look at for transparent companies that are specializing in this in dream manipulation and dream recording. You know, one kept coming up that's called Dormio, D-O-R-M-I-O, and they produce a headband and also a wristband that actually monitors your dreams and records them, but also influences them. The same way some companies are using ads right now to influence people to look at certain products and certain um, cravings. And they're doing this actually on like alpha state type of a, a level brain entrainment. It's really something else. I'll put a few pictures of that up too. But when dealing with that and dealing with these type of incubate, these incubated dreams and how what they're really doing, I want to make this very, very clear. What they're doing is turning dreams into memories and those memories into reality. And they're also doing that through a hive mind. I've talked about an SSP and mind control video. I went over that. I went over that in the brain hacking video. Videos that are not popular with people and also the hijacking of the contactee narrative. Something that <clears throat> somebody recently said, oh, that's high school stuff. Oh, high school stuff. All those... <laughs> All those surveys done by CCRI, by those academics, that's child play, over thousands of, of, of contactees and experiencers, that's child's play, high school stuff, are you kidding me? Anyway, going forward with that, um, this, um, this dream incubation process and what they're doing, and when I hear it using, they're using the hive mind, this is very real, I've talked about the hive mind before, and when saying that, you know, I'm hearing people in the disclosure movement saying, you know, stuff like, oh, uh, it's very important for disclosure movement, such and such and such and such. And I had a dream about them that we're doing this and that, and we're doing other things and people doing these different things. And then, you know, and other people are saying, oh, I had that dream too. You know, I'm hearing that a lot of times around like community and stuff like that. And, you know, it, multiple times. And when you hear that, that means something. These people were exposed to this type of dream incubation technology and the hive mind technology that I'm talking about. That's what that is. And how that's actually infiltrating into actually people's experiences and they would think it's real. So I'm not putting it down, all right? But man, that dream simulation technology like this would seem completely real. And I always pay attention to that when people tell me, oh, I've had clients say this. There's like me and then there's like the other me. Or when you have a client that you take really deep and they start describing these type of technologies. All right, now I've, I've had it several times. A lot of times they're light impulses that are done optically or it's sound induced technology. This stuff is real, all right? And we've got people that are psychic and contact these experiences that are being targeted, targeted individuals. So just that's something I want to bring to the Fourier, or to the, just, excuse me, to the forefront. And I really advise people and encourage people to look up this technology for yourself. See how many stuff you can find out that's even transparent in the community, these different companies, and then taking that all the way to the stuff we're not hearing about that's being used on targeted individuals. It's not just the microwave weapons and things we've heard about that are directed energy weapons and plasma weapons. It's also these type of technology that attacks those that are both contactees that come in here altering their experiences, okay, and also mediums and psychics. So this is really, really important how this ties in. Um, uh, I think that really kind of ties into this, coming into my videos. So just kind of look this stuff up, all right, and keep this in mind when you're hearing testimony. And I'm not trying to discredit anybody, all right, with their experiences or anything, but I'm saying this is a reality that needs to be investigated. In fact, I do believe, um, in fact, I'll see if I can find the link to that and I'll put it up. Desiree Foley is having a, her company, they're having a uh, conference. There's several doctors and people that are gonna be there, I think, that are trying to bring this to Congress, this type of weaponry, these experiments that are being done. 
And that's that, that's a big move, you know what I mean? We have real professionals doing that and I commend that definitely. So and I wish them the best of luck and hope the stuff comes to light. Please subscribe to the channel, push the like button, uh, push the bell. I'm coming to an end with my videos. My friend PC is leaving, so uh, much love for all the videos we've done together. And bitchy blessings to your family. We've been going eight years hard on this, and that's 400 videos. So many thanks. Please subscribe. Thank you to people on Patreon. Much love.